Hello, I'm Lenny, and this is Angela. Angela. That's Angela. So, uh, we haven't done a whole lot of stuff since we left uh, Virginia or Ohio or wherever we were, but we are in Florida now, and today is November 2nd, I think. And is it not? Third? Third. November 3rd. And uh, we were sitting around and we decided let's go for a little ride. So we are in the Ocala National Park Forest, forest National Forest. Um, and we did a Jeep Badge of Honor. There's a Jeep Badge of Honor trail here, which if you don't have a Jeep Wrangler, it's basically an app and they have trails that are certified by Jeep that you can go there. And it's just kind of a little thing where you get uh, a little badge. Here, I'll show you the one we got in Michigan. Right there. And you have to, you know, be close enough where the GPS says you're at the trailhead. And then you do the trail, and then they will mail you a badge. It's kind of free. It's a gimmicky thing, but it works. Because it got us out to do this. It was about an hour to get here. But what else do we got to do, really? And look, we get to see wild animals. There's a wild animal over there. Wild animal. Oh. What is that? It looks like it's uh, some sort of a bear slash uh, slow. What? What'd you say? It's a bear bobcat. It's a bear bobcat. It's a cow horse. It's a cow horse. And uh, so we did our little check in and uh, we drove down the trail a little bit. It's just basically sand. The, the way the Jeep trail rating system is one to 10. This one is anywhere from a one to a four. I'm guessing it's a one today. I don't even know if you need four wheel drive and probably a four if there's a hurricane going on, but. Different spots are probably different. Yeah, it's probably different spots. It's all sand. Uh, this is a pretty hard pack where I'm standing, but coming up here, it was kind of rutted. I, you do need four wheel drive and a high clearance vehicle. It's probably about eight inch ruts. So not bad. This is a big, big place. I don't know how many miles into it we've gone, but we're just gonna drive around a little bit and uh, goof around and head home. It's a good place to get some dash cam video, I guess. Here we go, Jeep Adventure. came in uh, a little faster than I thought. It only took like a week. This is what it looks like when it comes in the package. And you gotta put a little bit of it together. So I'm gonna do that. You take it out of there. And uh, you got the metal part here. You gotta remove this little sticker. This glues onto there. And then you're removing the one in the back and you put it on the Jeep. So I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna do this part first because it seems like the easiest. Pull this off. This is it. Super high grade industrial strength tape. So you've got to make sure you get her on there right. Which that part's pretty easy. You'd have to be an idiot to mess that up. Okay, that's on there. So now before I put it on there, I got a little rubbing alcohol. And I'm going to clean just to get the road grime and stuff off of there, clean that surface. I'll clean this off a little bit. I'm gonna put it right below the Michigan one. Try that off. That'll be good. Throw this up here. 
This part I'm going to use both hands for. As long as this doesn't fall off. And they tell you that uh, make sure you get it right because if you try and pull this thing off you could damage your paint and clear coat and all that stuff. Because it's the same kind of tape and glue they use for all your other emblems. Make sure it's right side up. Put it right there. And next to it. Line it up. Good enough. Let's take a look there. All right, look at that. Got the Michigan one, and now the Florida one. And that's all there is to it. Two of them. Something fun to do. And then nothing else going on. There'll be a lot of them out west when we get out there. Just stacking them up all the way down. Okay, that's it. Let's wrap this video up.